Hey guys, Seth Fuller, your favorite giver here. I want to thank everybody who donated to my Just MF and Give program through the MF Nonprofit Corporation. If you haven't yet, go now. We got about $4,800 raised so far, which is awesome. Now, $4,000 of that is in a form of a used car that runs great, has AC. We're going to be giving that away soon, so watch out for that video. But I thought I'd start with a video of a pair of shoes because um, that's what I have ready and I think this is an awesome one so this is a for a young man named Zaid now I saw Zaid on a SBSK video if you haven't seen the SBSK uh, channel it's pretty cool it's all about uh, kids with disabilities and people with different um, issues that they're dealing with and uh, just uh, informative empathetic just awesome way to celebrate those people Zaid was on there this is a kid, and I'm just warning him. This is graphic. I'm going to show you a picture of him. It's graphic. Zaid, through an accident involving a candle when he was young, was um, burned for most of his body badly. And it's just a miracle. I mean, this kid faces more adversity every day than most people do in their entire lives. Um, Zaid can't run from the scars and the disfigurement that this accident caused so I'm not going to either I'm gonna embrace it and in fact that's kind of the idea of these shoes is that maybe they can be a starting point for a conversation take a little attention off of the things that might make your average person uncomfortable which is just the reality that this young man faces every day so I hit him up over Facebook he told me hey man I, I do like um, Hindu uh, religious uh, uh, imagery and Star Wars and I said oh Star Wars is boring but the Hindu imagery that's gonna be awesome so I'm gonna uh, I did a pair of shoes for him now I he, he's blind so um, one thing he's trying to do is maybe get some sort of corrective surgery now they're doing amazing things with that so if you can donate to him I'm going to put his donation down here in the description but in the meantime I made him these shoes and I'm gonna describe them to him so Zaid this is as much for you as for anybody man I hope you enjoy these shoes um, and so here they are okay so on the right shoe or left when you're looking at it I have Ganesha, um, also known as Ganapati and Vinayaka. Um, this is one of the best known and most worshipped deities in the Hindu pantheon. He is found, you know, throughout Hindu religion. Um, he is re readily identified by, of course, his elephant head. So here for you, Zaid, I painted, a, or excuse me, drew on and, and markered a um, pink elephant-headed god. I used a, a very cool picture that I found on Google Images. He has kind of the standard in every picture, um, tattoos of some symbols and um, some writings that he has tattooed on his forehead and down his trunk. I don't know what those means. Maybe someone can tell us. Leave in the comments below if you know. Now, Ganesha is the patron art of arts and sciences and is the uh, diva of intellect and wisdom. So um, I thought that was a pretty cool symbolism. I like the elephant uh, vibe. So I have his trunk curling around. These are both busts. So it's kind of from the chest up. Ganesha here is pink in color. Um, tried to shade it pretty cool. He has beautiful eyes because he's a beautiful god. Um, and uh, he has one tusk missing this is uh, kind of like um, dualism is is he's fighting against dualism and he removed one tusk to write some of his wisdom down he's holding up his right hand he has a heart in that hand that's kind of a glowing ruby heart he's wearing a beautiful gold crown um, with a ruby in the middle of the crown um, he has uh, some rainbow kind of lily leaves behind him that are kind of I don't know framing the crown I, it was just something that I found often in the when I was uh, looking around at Hindu art and I thought it was uh, pretty beautiful and it's kind of uh, given them that majestic holy highlighting that uh, I thought looked very cool on this shoe on the left shoe or right on the screen I uh, painted Brahma now Brahma is a lesser known God but honestly I found what I thought was the coolest drawing of all the gods, which is Brahma here. He's a three-headed god. They have him as a, a, an older man. He is Indian in complexion. He's some very nice brown skin tones. I tried to make him 
um, appear Indian in origin thought that would be appropriate he's got a beautiful white flowing beard or three of them because he has three heads the main one is obviously up front one on each side facing to the side I kind of did a profile of each um, his eyes are glowing they're like electric and the electricity is actually going between his eyes and the other two uh, heads eyes so it was a very cool effect I thought it turned out really well they're wearing kind of a, a single crown but you know with three faces also um, with lots of um, colored uh, gemstones in it very cool looking very powerful looking crown there and um, both shoes are painted in a, what I would call a mint green with a dark green border um, both gods are wearing blue um, Ganesha has a, a blue frock on with a, a ornate green kind of large collar and Brahma is wearing a blue vest with an open chest um, barely showing and um, so you can wear these with a I think a wide variety of colors and they'll look good with a lot of different things but I think they turned out well I certainly hope they can serve as kind of a, a conversation piece and to to start up some new friendships hopefully um, I hope you enjoy them I think they're cool um, I think uh, you'll think they're cool and I think anybody like you who's into the religion of uh, Hindu religion mythology and iconography and just Indian art in general would enjoy these um, thanks for uh, allowing me to do this for you I hope you're doing well and I hope these serve you well appreciate everyone who gives just MF and give just MF and give um, if you go to mfncorp.org or justmfandgive.com or you can click below in the link and just donate whatever you can. It all goes to a good cause. We are an official nonprofit, 501c3. Um, so uh, help us out. Help everybody out. We, we, got, we do nothing but good things. Um, so thanks for watching. And uh, oh, I wanted to show you. Um, this is an older shoe I wanted to show you, but um, it's technically on brand because it's a. Uh, for a differently abled person, my boy Scotty Dew, he's an awesome DJ. Um, if you hear the sound of the, the uh, music in the beginning, it's for him. Um, uh, he does have cerebral palsy, um, but again, he doesn't let that really stop him. Uh, you know, one of the coolest guys I know. So he, he liked these shoes I made, which is um, some old school Frank Miller. Dark Knight, Batman, suede vans with the um, dope paint, dope Frank Miller artistry. Really cool. So I thought that throws those in there. Again, gonna keep doing those things. Thanks everybody, and hope you have a good one.